Hello to YouTube and uh, welcome back. We got another uh, Phasmophobia here. Today is a a little bit of a jumbled up day because Friday I have a dentist appointment. I don't have a dentist. I have a dentist appointment. Um, so the challenge wheel has been pushed back. Today is Wednesday and we're going to be doing some challenge wheel. Um, I don't remember the last time. Things worked, but not 100%. I've adjusted the wheel. I've adjusted it. And uh, I'm going to be changing it eventually. But we have uh, options to be able to change things on the fly. So it's going to make things easy to fix if something breaks. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. And if you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. We're going to be in our first spin. <coughs> uh, also, it hides itself now. So nothing stupid pops up. So when I hit this button, you'll see the wheel. <laughs> As opposed to how it was before when uh, it wouldn't quite work that way. Um, first off, I'm going to remove a couple of options on here. Uh, so before I even get started, I'm going to remove that. Well, actually, you know what? That was fine. I just wanted to remove it. So I can't, I can't take it. Um, if you do a uh, sub or 3,000 biddies, uh, I will keep track of it. And next stream, if I see you on, I will make sure to reaper it up for you. Or, um, if I manage to find, uh, the bean boozled before next stream, uh, which, which would be possible, very much so possible. Um, I will, um, make sure to do that for you. Uh, but anyways, let's get on into it. Let's get our very first spin. Let's see what the wheel has in store for us. Uh, and also, uh, I need to do some uh, Apocalypse Challenge uh, as well. Uh, I don't plan on doing it tonight, but if things go well with the wheel, we'll see. Maybe the last couple of tries, uh, the last couple of posts will be the uh, Apocalypse Challenge. We'll see. Um, and also, we got the hit list as well. Uh, that is always a thing. And I will pull that up for a uh, prediction in just a moment. Go ahead and spin. Oh, sure this looking here. Wow, looky there. We got one that I've been working on and adjusting to make sure it works for this. We got a picture roulette. Lovely. And of course, if you haven't seen what picture roulette is, um, here, here's what I would say. Well, first off, I have to get the other wheel set up. Oh, or just click this button here. There we go. Uh, every single item in the game is on there. And uh, we go in with a flashlight and picture, yeah, flashlight and photo camera only. And uh, we have to get pictures of ghost interactions, anything like that. I'll explain it again, of course, as I get in there. Um, but this is uh, the personal challenge wheel that I usually do on Fridays. We go today. We are ready to go. So now I should be able to do this. I should be able to do this in game, actually. So I should hide it. There you go. Uh, Okay, and then we will, oh, I don't have a hotkey for that. That is unfortunate. Um, we'll pull up the hit list here. Of course, if you don't remember the hit list from last time, yeah, I had a couple of whiffs and I uh, only ended up getting six ghosts, apparently. Yeah, it wasn't the cleanest uh, few runs. Uh, anyways, uh, so the hit list, is going to go like this. You get a prediction if you think it's going to be a new ghost. You wager your points on new ghost. If you think it's going to be a repeat, you wager your point. repeat, repeat option on repeat. Oh, wow. My brain really has been just absolutely mush uh, since I caught the it's like this time around. Last time around, I was fine. Now, this time around, I've, I've been mush brain. Mush brain a lot. I'll have to keep track of the. Um... <coughs> Deaths for me as well. That, that was one thing I didn't do last time. I gotta fix the colors of this. This is so ugly. Here, I'll show you. That's not what I'm talking about. <laughs> but there's, there's a new version of uh, what I made. So there you go. Uh, uh, I'm gonna try to figure out a way how, how to put this, like, and actually keep it on screen. Um, uh, obviously, you saw I just clicked it and uh, it popped up. Well, you didn't see I clicked it, it just popped up. It's magic. Um, 
but yeah, it's something that I figured out how to do here. Um, there you go. Okay, yeah, that's what I look at. <laughs> but yeah, I gotta fix the colors and stuff of, of this. It's just it's so wild now. You know, things things need a, a touch of paint every uh, once in a while. Okay, um, get our first prediction. Prediction seems to be working. The six ghosts are going to be the repeats as of right now. But, uh, yeah. Not the best, I'll tell you that much. So we will, uh, flip this. Yep. Okay. There we go. So many hotkeys. Um, I'm going to go ahead and bring a second. And of course, there's photo relap in uh, just about everything I usually play in Nightmare. Um, there are a couple of challenges on the wheel, which will increase the difficulty immensely. Immensely. Alright, we're here. That Take a look at the equipment and prepare Hello, accordingly point. before starting the investigation. Hold on. Whoever was here must have summoned the ghost with a cursed object. Investigate it, but be careful. I don't know what it's capable of. How far over dues we need to. What do we think? Right there, centered? Close enough? Scoot it down a touch. That's not bad. I just don't want to cover up too much information. It's just, you know, need to have that logo, but we don't need to have it. Better in the bigger, bigger. Okay. Eddie Houston. Oh, we got Cordy Wilson. And let's see. Okay, so the way photo relap works, picture relap. I always call it something different. Every, every time I play it, I call it something different. Um, we got a picture camera. And did I add flashlight to that wheel, actually? No, flashlight is not on that wheel. I could add flashlight to the wheel to really um, hinder, but uh, for now, we'll, we'll stick with the original design of photo roulette, <clears throat> picture roulette. I'm just going to call it photo roulette from now on. I'm going to rename it on everything because I can't keep track of what I called it. Okay, uh, so the way that the uh, picture roulette, photo roulette works, uh, you fill up your journal, I almost pressed J, I don't use J anymore, uh, with three star photos, it doesn't matter if it's one star, two star, three star, as long as it gives a, a star, it counts as a spin on the uh, photo roulette wheel. And uh, ghost photos count as two spins. And then all these objectives also count as one single spin. So they all uh, help to gain items. You can only use any items that are spun on the wheel specifically. If you do not spin it on the wheel, you cannot use it. Easy All right. Let's start with our first spin. of the cursed item, which I believe is tarot card. Is it? Mug. Tarot mugs. Uh, it's a picture of bone, picture of cursed item, picture of mannequin. I heard that. First set of rooms. Got the bone. That is one spin, and we can spin Right off the bat. A crucifix. All right. Well, that's not a bad one. 
With that, I actually was able to chase all the fire on it. And then do anything. <laughs> it makes it so simple. I want to say it was one of these first rooms. Um, we see the curse. I didn't see one yet. Was it in there? Was it a monkey? Monkey. Need monkey. All right. Spinning. Sound sensor. Lovely waste of time. I'm not even gonna bother to go get that. I definitely heard something about this here. Maybe it was back here. Oh, these doors are wide open. Give me a sign. These doors look like they're interacting. Come, buddy. I mean, we could just wish for um, sanity or whatever. Um, turn on my heart rate monitor there. So are you living room? Is that what you're, what you're doing here? Is that what you're telling me? You're telling me you're living room ghost. I mean, I'm not getting cold breath. I'm not getting cold breath anyway. What's going on, ghost? Hmm? Uh, this light was turned off. Throwing this bear out of here before it starts interacting with it. Give, uh, give me a sign, please. Give me a sign. We might have to go straight for a hunt here. This is, uh, <clears throat> give me a sign. Uh, I've been getting no interactions. Give me a sign. Is there anything here? Is there even a ghost here? Give me a sign. Do something. Where are you? Give it. Oh, wait a minute. We got cold breath. Oh, you're in here. All right, give me a sign. Do something. Oh, hello. That's a spin. Uh huh. All right. UV. UV or not to UV. Definitely need UV. Beautiful, beautiful. Now what I want to do is uh, when I get these items. I want to show like a little picture. I think I can just, just I can display a picture on screen, but I'd rather like do like a emoji or emote type deal. And obviously that's not possible without actually having it as an emote. So I need a bunch more emote slots. I need a bunch more emote slots. I need 24 emote slots. I definitely need a main one. A main emote's got to be a tripod. <clears throat> Give me a sign. Do something. Give me a sign. Give me a sign. Do something. Give me a sign. Get that picture. That's a picture. Firelight without a candle isn't going to help me. Give me a sign. Do something. Give me a sign. Come on, show yourself. Be a ghost photo. Uh, I need a picture of ghost. Picture of ghost would be three spins. Uh, ghost event. Anything. Come on, buddy. Give me a sign. Give me a sign. Do something. 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 Give me a sign. Can you give me a sign?
Can you give me a sign? Oh, can you? Oh, can you? My microphone's different. Is my microphone a different? Something's not. Ah, dang it! <laughs> poop on a loop. Poop. Poop, poop, poop. Poop. Ugh, that's a little poop. Well, before I continue. I'm gonna quickly reset my microphone. One second. Okay. Um, that's a little bit. Okay. Uh, I don't know why the sound is so strange for the microphone right now. It's it's quiet. It's too quiet. I don't know why. I've literally changed nothing. Eh, maybe I'll have to listen to this one back. Like the desktop audio was too loud right now. Weird. There's some weird wild stuff. Alright. <clears throat> hey, closer. Hmm, closer. Okay. Nice man. Okay. Well, we did get the uh, event, so that gets me a spin. Okay. Not too bad. Bring in dots. Uh, you're still in here, right? Yep. Alright, there's no way you'll be able to hide dots from me. So I take it's not a dance ghost. <laughs> uh, that's, oh, nice the interaction. <laughs> Thought that was a hunt. I hate it when they do those. Okay, so you just walked away from the lighted area to break a light. Yeah, that was such a long event. All right. Spirit box. Spirit box is good. What was that? Okay, I'm not sure what door that was. Let's go get that spirit box. It does seem like this coast is getting Where are you? The far region. Okay. First evidence. There. Just roll with that. Let me move this to the hall. <coughs> no 
Okay, I mean, we're just kind of waiting for another interaction to happen. Uh, give me a sign. Could do... Wait. Oh! That one. Uh, I'm not going to risk two. Yep. Oh, here, we got one more. Like, I'm not going to risk two. Sensor ain't gonna help me. Give me a give me a sign. I mean I can't I can't do anything with that one now. Where is the uh there it is. Broken. Okay. If this is the ghost room. It's not messing with the light. It's leaving the ghost room's light on. It just doesn't seem very mare-like to leave it on. It seems more Motel 6-like than, uh, than a mare. Alright. Uh, we'll touch again. Uh, we got another spin. Something got thrown somewhere. Incense? Uh, but no peppermint. Well, poop. Is there any other objectives I've got? Nope. <laughs> Don't! Get out of it! And then something popped up, <laughs> which threw me off. All right, well, it's broken its light in its room now. Light break event twice. I can do a Dio test. It's definitely not. Gotcha. Gotcha. Triple picture, baby. Ha ha! There we go. Finally, we get some good news. We got photo of ghost. Ghost photo. That is three spins because we got two for spin or two for uh brain. Two for taking a picture of ghosts, plus one for the inner, or, uh, the, the, that thing. Objective. <laughs> okay. Headgear, that doesn't help me. Okay. Photo camera definitely doesn't help me. Uh, that's a, uh, a respin. Let's <laughs> try. All right, that's two spins so far. Look, okay, okay. And the final spin. EMF. We got all except for thermometers. We got book and EMF. Okay. Uh, oh, Jesus. It means we're going to need the ghost to see me during a hunt. <coughs> oh boy. Yippee. Uh, this door was fully shut. Got it. This door? Nice! Ah, run! <laughs> okay. Um, could definitely be a mare, on at 60%, but, uh, we got, uh, two more photos. Yep, we got two more pictures. Okay. Come on. Why 
lighter. All right, we got incense and lighter. And the last one is going to be salt, which doesn't help me at all now. Um, so we lost out on thermometer, sanity pills, video camera, and parabolic mic. So that's what we missed out on uh, for this picture roulette. Not bad, just being down four. Uh, which, I mean, we can survive a hunt. That is a big deal. It... No, that's not Breaker. Oh, it's not a Phantom. That's right. It's not a Phantom. Oh, we could test for Wraith, the Salt. I almost forgot. Turn out some lights. Let's throw that in there. And then we can grab salt. I don't believe it's a wraith, but we'll do this anyway. We can also do that defensively. Can't be a URA, right? No, can't be a URA. An ad break. Sit outside for a minute. This ghost is very boring. Now that I think about it, um, spirit. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Oh, yeah. That's oh, is that what popped up? Stupid. No. I don't care, CC Cleaner. Go away. Go away. But I bother. I need that. <coughs> 30 seconds on ad. I mean, this is a uh, mare spirit. Like, it's, it's a boring ghost. Um, it hunted uh, fairly higher than average, so it could be mare, yokai. Uh, Moroi, if I was cursed, uh, we'll know if it's fast. Uh, 10 seconds. We'll go ahead and start getting back in there. Ghost appears to have uh, screwed up another light. Neat. Uh, and then I could always do monkey bow. Second burn. Who sees out of the picture? Let me set up just in case I need to super hide. I can hide right there. This ghost is fast. Get <clears throat> mute. Uh, so, what to watch for? Uh, we're going to watch for. If this ghost is fast, it is a Moroi or a Dio. Uh, if this ghost is normal speed, it's between a spirit mare. Yokai, I could try getting it to run over to me. Uh, if this ghost is a poltergeist, this table will be cleared. Not that it's showing any poltergeist tendencies. We always make a little file. It's hunting few and far in between, I've noticed. I don't know if that really indicates that. Is the spirit? Spirits can't hunt in between a longer range? I'm not sure. Uh, and then for spirit, of course, we're going to want to watch um, when I hit the smudge. Here it comes. Okay, it's normal speed.
walking through all the salt. It's not a wraith. Peekaboo. Line of sight speed. Okay. Well, that will narrow down a few ghosts here. I didn't smudge, so we will have to do the spirit test again. Stupid radio. Um, but that's good though because we can rule out twins. Can't. Can't video camera, so I can't look for that one. Uh, we can check for the second evidence. It was definitely not a Dio. It's not a Moroi. Uh, not a Wraith. Did I get a firelight? I don't think we got a firelight, did we? Yes, we did get a firelight. Okay, we could do the Unreal test. Um, and then, yeah, we will have to smudge it for. Unreal test is not going to work. All right, let's, uh... Oh, yeah, I didn't smudge. That's right. I didn't smudge. So we're going to have to wait for the hunt again, which should happen fairly quick. I believe it's uh, 30 seconds or so in between, or 20 seconds in between we can hunt again. Come on, ghost. What are you doing? It's not hunting. It just... It just walked into the living room. It's not hunting. Why are you not hunting? <coughs> Mimic? Mimicking shade? It was Yokai in it and it interacted early. Yokai, Yokai, Yokai? Hello? Yokai? Ghost? Who are you? Hi, how are you doing? Yokai? Uh, it needs to hunt me. It needs to hunt me. I need to see if we can smudge for three minutes. Okay, same speed again. Then after it, thirty-four oh eight. Thirty-four oh eight. So thirty-seven oh eight is the spirit's time. Thirty-seven oh eight. Uh, we can check for um, evidence too. Thirty-seven oh eight. We do not have ghost riding. And then I 
I mean, I didn't hear any EMF fives, and I didn't see any dots. So, I mean, that would rule out spirit, but thirty-seven oh eight rules out spirit. Let's. No. Oh, well, hi. How are you? Stop doing that. What was that all about? It it bounced. <laughs> nice. It, it reflects and stuff off of this. Oh, uh, that's funny. Alright. 3708. So 30. 3408. Um, it has been a minute and a half. Here it comes. It's not a spirit. What are you then? Hey, hey boo. what are you? Are you a mayor? You could be. I'm not quite sure. I mean, what it could have done. Can you find me? Mm, not thinking it's your kind. But what is Mirror's other evidence? Ghost writing ghost orb. <laughs> okay, well, so it would have been ghost orb then? I'm gonna assume this isn't a mimic. What's on the Freezing and ghost. Son of a bitch. So the only ghost I could figure out right now would be a mare if it's giving that, but it's not. It's pro probably giving ghost. Spirit would be EMF 5. It's definitely not a spirit, it's not a poltergeist. <laughs> At this point, I don't believe it's Yokai. I think it's Mare, and it did try to hunt early. I think that's the only safe bet at this point. Oh, I escaped the ghost. I get one more spin. I almost forgot about that. That's right. We can reset. Okay. That gives me another option. Let's reset. Let's go to 75, 70% or so, and let's do an on Rio test. Uh, give me another crucifix. All right. Yeah, let's get back to about 75%. And let's do an on Rio test. That way we'll know for sure if it's between Mayor and on Rio. Are you still in here? Peekaboo! Answers that question. You're in hallway now, I see. <laughs> just just in case. <sighs> Why'd you throw the poor dog picture? Give me a sign. 
You are a mayor. Thank you very much. Yeah, so I was dead. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. That could have been yokai. Right. 70. Because how much, how much do the tier three pills? Is it 60? It might be 20% a piece, which 20% a piece would make sense because American hunt is 60%. It's definitely not non real. It's between a mayor and a yokai. Um, here, let's do this. Let's mute. Let's get absolute proof that this is indeed a mare. Mare can hunt in the dark at 60%. Uh, a yokai can hunt at 75%. Or 85% we're talking. I'm muted. So only the mare can hunt at this point. And I'm going to turn on a main light. And then the mayor can't hunt in the night until 40%. Hey, you son of a bitch. Well, we're at 50% now. Stop it. Going mayor. Yeah, mayor makes sense. I am just so confused why I didn't get any other evidence. I mean, it must have been ghost orb. It must have been ghost orb or freezing. Welcome back. I've prepared some jobs for you. Mm. Here I was about to praise them. Saying that they did such a great job fixing the Oreo. It is now back to being an off-brand ghost. It is no longer an Oreo. It is now a, you know, what, what is the other brand? Uh, Hydrox, it is a Hydrox. The Unreal is now, oh, I can't even say that word, so it's going to be called the Hydrox from now on. I am no longer referring to the Oreo as the Unreal as an Oreo. It is now a Hydrox because I hate it that much. There was clearly a firelight sitting there in the crucifix burn. Explain that. This is why the tier three crucifix blows. It does not work with the Onryo. This is why I prefer the tier two crucifix for pretty much every situation, except for when poking the dial constantly. <coughs> Unfortunate. On Rio. I mean, are you kidding me? On Rio. Was a new ghost. And of course, it doesn't count. That took forever. That took absolutely forever. Nearly an hour? That ghost really sucked. All right, let's get a another spin. Uh, back to the main wheel. And, um, oops. Oh boy! It's a new challenge! That is indeed a new challenge something I'm gonna have to explain a little bit. We'll get a new prediction going here. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. New ghost and repeats. Uh, nothing's changed. A lot of those ghosts are still new ghosts, which is unfortunate. 
Okay, um, for this one, I will go ahead and keep tier four six. I uh, will go to Edgefield and uh, we'll start. And uh, this challenge, I come up in my I come up with it in my head. The simple fact that you know getting one star photos and two star photos have become a lot easier. Um, so here's the deal. Right now, this challenge is going to be hmm, fairly fairly easy, and obviously I want to make it more difficult this time. It's on make it better this game. So <coughs> as easy as one, two, three is as easy as getting. A one star photo, a two star photo, and a three star photo. And you have to fill up the journal with one star photos, two star photos, and three star photos. Um, how many picture slots are there? We could actually do one one star photo, two two stars, and three three stars. Because there there's definitely enough slots to do that. Or we could do, we need to get... Uh, one, two, three, one, two, three, as in a one star goes, one star photo, two star photo, three star photo. I think for now, as long as I get a one star, a two star, and a three star, then we have passed. Um, but we could do one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, and then end it on a one. The last photo has to be a one star. We'll see. Well, we'll see what happens here. Um, but we also have to figure out what the ghost is. So, uh, Gregory Sherman. Sherman. Oh, I can't do that voice right now. Sherman. Uh, the objectives don't really matter. Okay. Excuse me. So we go back to uh, just a regular nightmare. With the additional challenge of one, two, three. This is going to be interesting because I've never tried this before. Uh, who play tests something before they try it? Come on. That would be silly. Ouija board. Okay, let's do this. Grab the Ouija board. Let's set it down. And let's get a one star photo of the Ouija board. That, that's gotta count. Yes. All right, so that is the name of the challenge right there. We got a one star photo. So now the next one needs to be a two star photo. I think that's the challenge right there. We need to get one, two, three in a row in order for it to count. I think that is the challenge. We'll do that. That sounds fantastic. That sounds hilarious and that sounds awful. All at the same time. That could, we could get two star interaction off of um, the Ouija board, couldn't we? You get two star ghost photo. Do we try to get the one, the two star interaction off of it? I mean, it's range based, so it shouldn't be too difficult to do. All right, where's this ghost? I always, uh, like this hiding spot set up here. If we find the bone, we could uh, plan on the two star photo for the bone. away from it. so bad at those light switches now. Ooh, 
that swings backwards. <laughs> All right, Ghost is probably downstairs in the basement. Not upstairs. Oh, let me shut this light off. Don't want a tripper breaker. <laughs> okay, it's the bone in the living room. Yep. Eh, bone's probably downstairs with the ghost then. Here. Oh. Okay, let's try to get the two star. Okay, so that would already be a fail. Wow, that was a three-star photo from in the hallway? Ugh. Rough. That was this door. Okay, we need a one-star photo of it. We got the one-star photo. All right. <coughs> ah! Ugh. Shit. And three star How are we doing that? How are we getting a three-star photo? Okay, it's we need a one-star photo again then. Dang. Hi, BB. Uh, this temperature is so slowly dropping. Don't tell me they hot fix this already. Oh, please don't ruin the best item in the game already. It's so slow. Okay, so what do we got? So we need to get star photo. Okay, interaction. That's definitely a one star. Yes, one star. I wonder how much money this actually. <laughs> Probably screwed myself over with that. All right, let's get some evidence. All right, ready? Two star. Yes. All right, we just need a three star. All we need is a three star photo now. Uh, we can't get the picture of the ghost. So we need a three star interaction or uh, anything else. Let's let's get some evidence in there. Let's, let's actually figure out what this ghost is. <laughs> let's play the game. <laughs> Who does that? Uh, salt, 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 salt. What the hell is that? I think this ghost is getting absolutely aggravated with me. And that's our three-star photo. It's as easy as one, two, three. There it is. One, two, three. And we had one more round left in case we screwed it up. There you go. So that is the challenge complete right there. One, two, three. Um, let's try it one more time. Let's see if we can push her up a double or nothing, shall we? Okay, so ghost is indeed in there. Uh, it is not fingerprints. So we are on nightmare, so, you know, no idea. Uh, I'll actually keep bringing it. Um, let's bring this, this. I bet you it's the EMF live ghost just because of the interactions it's been doing. It was, it was absolutely brilliant though with the uh, Ouija board. Oh, it touched that. Um, give me this. It is not fingerprints. So at this point, we can rule out the opaque. It cannot be an opaque. Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? How old are you? Are you friendly? Are you French? Are you pizza? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? How old are you? Are you friendly? Where are you? How old are you? How did you die? Are you friendly? Uh, I don't know. 
I couldn't think of anything else silly to say. Okay. Oh, you know what? We have to ask the Ouija board something. All right, what silly questions should we ask? We need to ask like the absolute stupidest question possible. Um, let me think. Oh, 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 oh I got the ultimate question. I wonder if, oh God, I can't answer. Let's see. All right, we'll give it a shot. What is the ultimate answer to the ultimate question? What is the ultimate answer to the ultimate question? How many pizzas do you eat? Goodbye. That's either two or 222. I'm going with 222. He eats lots of pizzas. Okay, so I can't answer that question, apparently. This is probably a Gorio. <laughs> lots of quick interactions there. Uh, no spirit box. <clears throat> Um, uh, one star photo. One star photo disturbs salt. Oh, we can get a two star photo disturbs salt. Eh. Nice, we got it. We did it again. Double or nothing, we're cracked. There we go. I don't think I've ever said that before in my life. There we go. Now let's see, can you do one, two, three? One, two, three, one, two, three, one. No, it would end on one. I saw bad bro, first time ever. One, three, one, three, and then one, two, three, one, two, three. As easy as one, two, three. And then you have to sing the song at the same time. <clears throat> there you go, That that that's the ultimate challenge. Yes, thank you. It is 42. <laughs> the ghost refused to answer it, but it did answer how many pizzas it ate. It had two pizzas. The ghost was hungry. Uh, let's go ahead and get book in there and let's look for Orbeez. Let's actually figure out what this ghost is real quick. I guess let's play the game. Ugh, who does that? There's even a five again. And that is a ghost orb. Right is dead. Uh, it's a Raiju or an Obeg. Hey, look at that. We know what the ghost is because there's no fingerprints. It is a Raiju. And this time. Okay. So this time, I know for sure that was a ghost orb. And I'm going to show it one more time to show that, yes, it is a ghost orb. Because the last time I did this, it was not a ghost orb. It was actually the ghost's head clipping. It was the craziest thing that I've ever seen. That's a ghost orb right there. See, you saw it, it's ghost orb. What should we yell at the ghost as we go out? <laughs> How did you die? How did you die? Oh man, how did you die? It's still active. How old are you? Okay. Whatever. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you. <laughs> All right, did we get our objectives? Uh, we got repel ghost. Yeah, it's broken. It's broken. That's all right. Oh, the hybrid. How are you today? Good Lord. I'm losing my voice already. I'm losing my voice because uh, I just did my own personal challenge and it worked. I succeeded at it. So this was the current challenge that got spun. And uh, it's as easy as one, two, three. There's a one star photo, a two star photo and a three star photo. And then I doubled it up. One star photo, two star photo, three star photo. As easy as one, two, three. I almost got it the first time. Uh, and it, it is a right. All right, I'm losing my voice now. 
<laughs> I should get a drink. And that time I saw a ghost story. <laughs> Was indeed a Raiju. Let's see, how much do we get for the photos? Forty-eight dollars. <laughs> so, <laughs> three three star photos are worth nearly a hundred and something dollars. And uh, <laughs> one one star, two star, three stars are apparently worth forty-eight bucks. <laughs> what did I do today? I worked. <clears throat> worked <laughs> and then came home and we bought we played code simulator for the rest of the night <laughs> he would have still been playing it too good god 29 percent sanity loss how long did that actually take 12 minutes not bad <coughs> all right uh that's still set right i don't need to reset it perfect get a spin What does the challenge wheel tell us to do? Oh, the challenge wheel tells us to get fucked. <laughs> All right. Well, at least I'm on Ridgeview. That's okay. Challenge wheel is unhappy with me now, apparently, because I succeeded. Well, screw you, challenge wheel. Um, that would be... I don't have a zero sanity on it. Oh, that's okay. I mean, it is technically kind of rigged, considering I'm the one that programmed it. It's a little rigged. Uh, nightmare starting zero. Zero. That's 5.18 times. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Looks good. I mean, originally it wasn't rigged and it was uh, wheel decide. Uh, the wheel decides wheel spin. Uh, I, I decided it was too much work to deal with having to flip on the website and actually interact with it. So now everything is within a touch of a button and it's all my own random things. And it is heavy rain, of course. Of course. It is always heavy rain when I deal with uh, a lot of these investigations. It's just what All right. Barely hear myself. All right, this is zero sanity. I will just actually do that. It's all right. It's on. The ghost isn't in the first room standing with me. Uh, breakfast right here. Lights. Lights are on. Here comes a hunt. Oh, shit. There he is. Uh, normal speed. So it's, um, piano room. Smudged at 103.15, I want to say. It's done. 103.15. Okay, so I think that's piano. Well, that was aggravating. <laughs> so I think it's in here. All right, let me get a crucifix in here. That was rough. Oh, I can't even do it. <laughs> let me get a crucifix. <clears throat> I'm gonna have to kind of cool my voice down a little bit. At least we'll save some of it. Yeah, I don't. Hi, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think I'll be able to go to the dentist and son of a bitch. It's gonna suck because I need this tooth removed and I need another tooth filled or something. I don't know. It is indeed in here. Nice call. Okay, so we got the crucifix. So at least it gives me a few seconds to set up. Need a destruction. Bring in another one, throw it in the house. I'm gonna go ahead and bring them all in and throw them in the house. Uh, and then I guess, you know what? Salt would be a good idea. 
<coughs> no, you, you didn't notice. I, I kind of I had COVID last week, and uh, I'm still fighting the effects of it entirely. And it's just like just not getting better. Like I at least feel like I'm not dying right now. Oh, no. It's about the only best thing I can say. Uh, let's see. What would be the easiest ones to throw in there? Okay, ghost get hunt now. It's a normal ghost. Um, that, that. Let's grab these and throw them in. There. More than likely, we're going to have to run to the bridge. Now. EMF five. <laughs> That's even. Kind of seems like it could be pulty throwing things. Oh no, that table's not cleared. Table's not even touched. Oh, oh, your hallway. Oh, okay, your hallway. Hey, okay, that works. Watch for a pocket shape chip and stuff like this. Um, you're not hunting. What did I say? 103.30? It's been three minutes. Are you a spirit? Touch the breaker. Hunt. Yeah, normal speed. Hello. 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 Alright. Uh, normal speed up. No Ibaki shapeshift. Uh, average throws? I'm not sure. No electricity. We're giving Valentine's to the ghosts. Uh, ghosts haven't given us anything yet. Um. <clears throat> Other than the, uh, the, other than the Unreal uh, being broken completely, and uh, I've decided to give it a new name. Okay, so uh, what do we got? we got? It's not a Dio. It's not a Thay. It's not a Moroi. There was an electronic throw on the ground, and it's not that one. Uh, my lane, maybe. Not a Pulte. That was visible quite a bit. No, 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 no deaths yet, so. No hugs yet. Uh, definitely not a Jenna, not a Phantom. Uh, not a Wraith, Stephen Saul. Not a Han 2. Not no Bake. Uh, not Twins, it was normal speed. I'm gonna say not a Demon. That was a, th that was almost a three minute hunt on the sponge time, and I did get the timer of this one. I didn't get a timer on this one, son of a... Um... Because I hit it about the end of that. So that was uh, 108. 45 seconds. How long have I been talking? <laughs> he just won't stop talking. I can't figure this out. All right, so it would have been about a minute and a half around. Now. <coughs> Excuse me. I just forgot our current challenges. Current challenges, zero sanity. I just realized something. You're not a demon, for sure. There's a crucifix right here in the area that it's been hunting from. Wait a minute. You came from the garage. You son of a bitch. Keep him in here. Okay. 
It definitely can't be a demon then, because it wouldn't have been able to, it would have triggered that crucifix. Meow. Um, we do well. That's too much. Uh, okay. Let's grab. Uh, which we grab? Oh boy. Man, I see one. That's just a spirit, but I keep missing the time. All right, I'll make sure make it a point next time I smudge it. I'm gonna say smudged at. Let me set up this. You've. It's gotta be a spirit. All right. It's gotta be a spirit. It is definitely in there. Just hunted it at 111.12 after I smudged it at 108. Gotta be a spirit. Gone. Okay. Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? How old are you? That mannequin moved. That mannequin bloody moved. I don't like it. Okay, I wanted to hunt for a few seconds before I smudge it. Hi. Hello. Is that a urine ability? Smudge at 11201. Can't catch me. And, and, and! Son of a bitch, that was the last second of the hunt. Ugh. Ghosts are giving me hopes. Oh, clip. <laughs> it was like. Uh, I got it right. <laughs> it was like that far away from actually hitting me. Well, I was right. I knew it was a spirit, and it was absolutely a spirit, but... Uh, maybe I should have sprinted back. Maybe that would have helped. Uh, all right, let's mark up a death there. First death of the night, and actually the first death of the week. Hit two streams. I still take that as a win. All right. <coughs> that was a repeat. <laughs> that was a repeat. Are you kidding me? I've had six ghosts over two streams. Well, nine ghosts, counting the three that I missed. Wow. Okay. And then we just go ahead and spin the wheel. Got... You're no evil. I'm going to need chat's help on this one. There we go. Okay, let's switch this back to Nightmare. Uh, and we're doing Grafton. Grafton, here no evil. You okay? That wasn't on camera at all. <laughs> Thank you. We've arrived. Check the equipment and get no, set up I, before I investigating. Don't I don't like them. Got the intel. Looks like this is going to uh -huh. be a tough one. We've had reports of violence, okay. and it looks like they left in a hurry. Yeah, the, um, uh, what is it? Uh, the Rice Krispie Treats, the packaged Rice Krispie Treats, the pre-made ones or whatever. I don't care for them. They have, like, that uh, fake marshmallow taste. It's like... I mean, they're okay. Hey, it's just they're, you know, they're, they're not Rice Krispie treats. See, the way that we always made Rice Krispie treats, I don't know if you made them this way. Uh, we always made them with peanut butter. Yeah, yeah, you do a little bit of peanut butter, and you do um, 
you basically make them how we make the note bakes, peanut butter and chocolate. And it makes them delicious. You don't really taste the peanut butter at all. It just gives like that kind of texture to it. <coughs> it makes them like really smooth. All right, we got Edward Mounsley. What kind of name is Edward Mounsley? Okay, um, if you didn't see it, the challenge is hear no evil. Uh, I'm going to turn my headphones down and take them off. So I'm going to need chance help trying to figure out not only if this ghost is interacting or doing anything, um, but like some evidence and stuff. I'll have no idea because I won't even notice. So I will definitely be watching Glancing Down, especially on Grafton, because Grafton is um, Grafton is rough when it comes to no um, no hearing. No seeing isn't bad because I typically run in like this. Let's see if we get a uh, see if we get a, a demon again because I did I did just get the uh, demon achievement being killed within the first 30 seconds. I got killed within seven seconds of entering this house. Hello. I found the ghost. <laughs> Alrighty then, a ghost is in the kitchen. Perfect. And it's not a fake. Are you okay? Okay, it's done. It's just standing there. It's just like, hmm. I don't think he even did anything. I think it just stood there just to say, yeah, I'm here. It didn't look around. It's supposed to look around. Like, it just stood there frozen. <laughs> what the hell is it doing? All right, the breaker's up here. What's really rough about this challenge is I don't know when there's a hunt. <laughs> so I might be walking around kind of flipping light switches. Is that a ghost there? No. All right. Let me at least turn on these red lights here. And then we'll go get some evidence items. I, th I think that mannequin moved from the, uh, from the kitchen in the other house. I definitely think it did. They just love doing Let's go grab some stuff. A piano? Okay, yeah. It could have been a piano, yep. Yeah. So, dining room then? It could be dining room ghost. Let's grab this. I've already tossed everything in there, so we could definitely double check that. Okay, so it's interacting between dining room and dining room. All right, I can at least use the EMF to kind of provide me a little bit of a clue. see if it's kitchen or dining it definitely seems to be kitchen interacting between both rooms okay it's kitchen going down hold on it's not going down wait a minute going up It's going down in Maine. It's in Maine. Okay, it's moved rooms. I want to say it's already moved rooms then. Let's put this here so I can kind of see it. Uh, let's bring these two here. Okay. So I got kitchen. Uh, I got kitchen for hiding. I got here for hiding. going on so far. Okay. Now I'm on a edge going between 
between the, these two rooms. All right, let's see if we get it. Where are you? Are you here? I think I need to show this. Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? How old are you? How old are you? Where are you? Are you here? Close? Fine. How old are you? Friendly? French? Pizza? Where are you? Where are you? How old? Where are you? Are you friendly? Are you French? Where are you? How old are you? Where are you? All right, Ghost seems to be in this room. Not getting a spirit box. I was hoping to have um, the Diogen response. Why did I bring both thermometers in? What the hell am I doing? Okay. Um, let's bring in ghost writing book. And, uh, oh, God. This is probably going to be writing in orbs, isn't it? it, it it's probably going to be mine. It'll probably be a mile. It'll be one of the shitty trio. It'll be next to impossible. <laughs> I'll have to have, uh, I'll have to have the flashlight on, sitting in front of me, and then point out, it's like, okay, it's flashing. <laughs> Do we hear footsteps? <laughs> Let's look for bees. Yeah, I see it behind me. Uh, see, see any ghost orbs? Harpy. Oh, did it pump up behind me? Where is it? I don't see it. Let's turn that on. Oh, Ema? Ema 4, I think. Nope, two. Uh, ghost riding. Ghost riding. The shower? What's the ghost doing upstairs? Ghost riding. Uh, she didn't do huh. Or is that just a sink? It could just be a sink. Oh, you know what? This light's off. Oh, I shut off. This one? Wait a minute. Should I go grab the parabolic? I don't know where I'm going. There is this bathroom, too. Uh, <gasps> monkey. Oh, wait a minute. Did I just see cold breath? I did. And this is not a bathroom. This is a storage room. <laughs> So it could be either here or it could be upstairs. I don't see any orbs. But it is still at me. Okay, so probably this one. I don't see anything going. All right. 
No ghost. No ghost. No ghost storm so far. No freezing. I don't see any UV evidence. Nothing. Nothing indicating that. There's been no spring. Okay. Well. What does that tell us? It tells us this ghost has been here. Need to get salt quick for the stuff. There's no bomb. Um, so no freezing. Maybe it's walking away from the area. But we have no spirit box, so none of those two yet. Not a shade. It did a ghost of it on my face. And at 99%. Okay, let me do salt. Bring the salt. Pretty quick, quick ghost. That, that, and here. I'm not sure if the ghost is like a clean area or not. We do have a pad break, so I might as well step out. Oops. Acid break. Uh, three with the early event would make sense. Demon would have hunted. So, no spirit box would rule out spirit in their poltergeist. But, yeah, there had to be a hunt. Uh, no ghost orb rules out Mayor Rev Fay. Uh, UV I'm going to have to watch for. EMF 5 for them guys. And then freezing with the poltergeist. Okay. Is uh, Unreal on there? Unreal is not. Okay, no adventure done. Oop, you just do an event? It just shut off a light. It's black. Oh no, it's broken. <laughs> good refresh. I'm good. It is not. Is not freezing. How about are you in here? You are not. You may just need to refresh the page. Sometimes that adds. have this on. Uh, false, false security. Alright. Uh, 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 uh. I mean, I might have to do this right now. Huh? Uh-huh. Your water. Okay, so it redid the water. Okay. It's gotta be kitchen.
Okay. the table from downtown oh it, 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 it did that it did that it did that hold on I think I put thinky 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 thingy I knew it was gonna get thingies Pulte oh good lord okay well this could be a pulty because of that throw right there um this is not a demon I would have died Oh boy. So this is between the big tosser or the tosser. Okay. Hmm. Let me do this. I'd like to get a hunt. Um the best way to set this up. Let me throw this in. Let's grab a flash. I'm going to throw it at my feet. We're going to get it to hunt. Come to the diner. And I'm going to loop it once. And hopefully determine it's a full drive. Because <laughs> that throw was very big. If it's a miling, good luck. <laughs> What's the speed difference? There is no speed difference between uh, Poltergeist and Miling. Or they're all three the exact same speed. Uh, these three are this normal speed. The only difference between the three is the Poltergeist toss, the Miling's. Uh, Quiet footsteps, which will fade in. Oh, good lord, the ghost is here. Uh, the Pulte Pile test does not work very efficiently. The ghost beer can test it seems to be working quite well, though. It is definitely throwing from very far. Don't have much luck. do is pile up a bunch of things on a table. You get it to hunt. I thought that was a hunt. And uh, you watch it throw. Uh, right now, if it's out of this room, we're going to listen for the footsteps if they fade in from a distance. We'll probably loop it and try to get it to uh, Follow me a little bit. It's definitely in the dining room now. But if we see this thing just explode this table, we're good. <laughs> that plant just moved. That plant just shifted. I think it might be easier to actually move the ghost in here, but I feel like doing it. Uh, it fades. It, it, I'm sorry, it doesn't fade. <gasps> it uh, slowly gets louder as it comes to you. So you'll you'll hear it. Um, uh, would it called fade in? That would be called fade in. Yeah, it fades in. <laughs> like, wait a minute. That's a, a technical term for editing. And the steps slowly get louder. Um, you won't hear them at all, and then they'll kind of be like, like they get, they'll get louder as they get close to you. Um, all the other ghosts have like the standard sound for it, but the miling has like a very quiet. 
and then it gets it gets to like normal normal sound. Ghost is not haunted. I'm not sure what my sanity is at, but I'm pretty sure it's low enough. Uh, it's monkey, so I could force fifty. It has stuff to be solved. Let me hang on for the No, I have no idea what this thing is doing. Okay. Alright. Let's just go ahead and do this one. I wish for sanity. That'll set me at 50%, so it should be hunting, uh, but now. Here it comes. Where are you? Oh, oh my lord, it was right behind me the entire time. <laughs> Good God. It's a poltergeist. <laughs> Dear Lord, buddy. You were on my ass. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Whoa. <laughs> Wowzers. <laughs> wow. I don't know how I survived that. Um, it did chuck a beer can straight up in the air, so that could have been a poltergeist toss, but it didn't clear the table. This could just be a myling. I mean, if we didn't if we didn't hear the heartbeat when it started hunting until I turned around, that could definitely indicate a myling. I mean, it's 100% not a demon. Ooh, dear lord. <laughs> the steps faded in. I mean, I am cool with going miling just because of uh, this thing, like, just popping up. Like, I didn't see it. I didn't see any fly. Oh, I didn't see any. Uh... I don't know. It, it, it definitely doesn't. It didn't seem like it did any big talk. But it did do like the big toss of that beer can the first time. <coughs> um, good lord, I was not expecting that. Better make a few. Got quiet. Yeah, which would be about normal. It getting quiet and further away from me. But uh. Like the miling, if you're the distance away from it that you need to be, you won't hear the footsteps at all. And then you'll hear them slowly. <coughs> I mean, we can get another test, obviously. I think that one was the first one. Yep. Uh, did I throw the other ones in there? Yeah. Here it comes. There you are. Okay, so that flashlight was flashing very early. Um, if you heard the footsteps as the ghost was coming closer to that flashlight, uh, then this is not a mind. If there were no footsteps before that flashlight was flashing, then it is a mind. Good, we got it. All right. Yeah, the basic gist of it is if you see that flashlight flashing, you do not hear footsteps. You hear them fade in as that flashlight begins to flash, but you don't hear any footsteps beforehand, then you know it's a mile. Um, and it's also absolutely not a poltergeist. That thing did not cost much at all. So I got the tap on there. I mean, I didn't hear anything, so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going miling. I heard no footsteps. <laughs> it was indeed a mile. Good job. <laughs> uh, 
I um, <coughs> I just had a feeling based off of uh, the ghost riding and uh, it not doing any uh, like main EMFs or anything. And then when I monkey pawned it and it moved rooms and it was just there. <laughs> and it seemed to just be there without the lights really flashing around. Like that is definitely, uh, definitely a miling abilities I do have to do my little um I don't have it yet but what I'm gonna do is kind of have like this um I mean obviously it won't do anything right now I'm gonna have like uh, a hyphen ghost or minus ghost like and it'll be like minus miling and it'll say uh what to watch for with the miling it's like uh you know the, the steps fade in so if you have a flashlight or you have electronic you don't hear the ghost and then as soon as it starts flashing, you hear steps kind of get really quiet and then start to crescendo a little bit and get a little bit louder. Then you're probably dealing with the mile. Those are still a little tricky for me to figure, figure out, to figure out as well. They're real tricky ghosts to figure out. Um, but that was a miling. I never did a uh, prediction, so <laughs> shoot me now. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and get a spin. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> All right, we got tarot cards. Tarot roulette. Let me pull up the hit list. Let's get a prediction. <laughs> ah, you're just the only one chatting right now. <laughs> All right. Uh, a new ghost would consist of all those ghosts that are not marked. Repeats would consist of the Banshee. Oh, sorry, not the Banshee. Spirit Mare, Phantom Pulte, Demon Miling, and Gorio. And the Demon was Demon Slayed. I got slayed uh, last. Last one. I am absolutely surprised that I survived that one, though. <laughs> I turn around and. Hi! <laughs> All right, we're doing Terror Roulette on Willow. I got it to flip the custom. Uh, we're doing that on track. Ba -ba. Tarot cards. Get ready up. Terror Roulette's very simple. I get into the house, all I can use is a flashlight, and I have to pull every single tarot card before I can start the investigation. These are always a blast when you have more than one person, but they're still quite fun uh, solo because every time I see tarot cards, I immediately have to pull. We got Gloria Gacy. It's the other cousin. What the hell's with Wayne Gacy's cousins? Oh, what am I doing? Stop it. Stop picking those up. Stop it. Stop it. It's a Um, all right, let's see. We got the tarot card. Let's go ahead and turn on the breaker. Do allow the rule of turning on the breaker. Eventually, I will stop that rule. I think when I hit case number 3000, I'll stop that. Rule. All right, let's do this. There, let's just turn on a couple of main lights here. And I mean, technically, you're not allowed to find. Okay, ghost is right there. Technically, you're not allowed to find hiding or anything. So you just have to start pulling. Hermit. The hermit. The town. Uh, the, the moon. We are at zero sanity. Ghost is in the garage. Shut that just to... Ghost is really fast. Moroi, they. It is not a Dio. Moroi, they. That is a toss up between the two ghosts. I'm dead. That sounds like they speed. 
That definitely sounded like a face speed. That, that sounded extra fast. Hey, man! Oh, I was about to say, I'm dead. The sun, I'm at 100% sanity, let's go. <laughs> All right, and we start over. We start the investigation over. Um, the Thay is one of the most interactive ghosts in the game. It starts out extremely active and uh, as the fastest ghost in the game, <clears throat> it does not have a line of sight speed. So if at any point the ghost does not have a speed up, uh, it is definitely a Thay. The Moroi is uh, sanity based. So the ghost, uh, if it's a Moroi, it would not be able to hunt uh, until uh, past 50%. The Thay can hunt is 75%. Um, and then we know it's not a Revenant because it didn't have line of sight on me. So it's literally down to these two ghosts. Um, the reason why I marked off the Dio is because it did not find me. Dio's will always find you. So yeah, it's between the Moroi and the Thay. Um, and if we get any evidence, <coughs> if we get Spirit Box, it's a Moroi. It cannot be a Thay. So... If it's not Spirit Box, it's a Thay. It's that simple. If it's on zero, uh, a zero evidence way of figuring it out is if you stand in the ghost room for said period of time and the ghost seems to be getting slower and then you can kite it, you will know it is a Thay. Because a Thay will get slower over time while the Moroi will get faster over time. Those two are the polar opposites of each other. <coughs> All right, let's just get a uh, spirit box. We literally just go in with spirit box and we'll be good. I mean, it's a cheat, but it works. <laughs> it could be a mimic. So um, we could not get spirit box and then we have to double check for orbs. I did say if the ghost was in the garage, right? I think if the ghost was in the garage. Let me double check. I should have brought it. Seem like this time. Yeah, let's go grab a thermometer. Oh, why I didn't. Always keep keep one on your hip pocket. I don't know why I don't bring the thermometer. Um, let's just bring this too. But yeah, since I got Moon, so I was at zero sanity, so the Moroi was at its fastest speed, if it was a Moroi. And um, the Thay would be at the fastest speed because I was not in the ghost room at all. So just between these two. Wait a minute. Which door was that? That was kitchen. Okay, so are you kitchen? I'm gonna say you're kitchen. Where are you? How old are you? Are you friendly? Are you French? Where are you? Where are you? How old are you? It's kitchen. Where are you? How old are you? Are you friendly? Are you French? Where are you? Are you pizza? How old are you? How old is pizza? Would you like pizza? Where are you? Hi. Oh, there you are. Thank you. Where are you? How old are you? Are you friendly? Are you French? Where are you? How old are you? How old are you? It's a thing. Hi again. You notice how active it is. It is an extremely active ghost. Um, and uh, <clears throat> it would, if uh, this active ghost doing so many ghost events back to back would be between an Oni or a Thay. And an Oni, if you get the ghost airball, it immediately rules out an Oni. But uh, definitely not a Moroi. There was no spirit box. I'm going to bring a camera. I almost forgot what it was. And uh, double check with that. Also for Thay, I believe it's freezing. If I'm not mistaken, I think it's freezing for Thay. I really have to make up my little uh, tips. My little tips and ghost guide. I, I tried. I tried. I had time. I, well, I didn't even have time to do it, so. I was planning on setting. I will set it up for, for next stream, which won't, won't be till Monday. So I got time. <laughs> Is there an extension? Um, <coughs> I 
don't believe so. I know there's like a click on screen one, but that's like, it's, it's not very practical. Like I can program this stuff with Sammy fairly easily. Um, this is just, it would just be a Twitch chat message. Like I just have to write it out. Look for ghost orbs. I mean, at this point, <clears throat> I've already ruled it down to it probably is just a they. But you always double check for ghost orbs. The one time you don't check for ghost orbs is the one time you get a mimic. Um, so yeah, definitely not spirit box. Uh, freezing wouldn't be they. So what are we looking for for they? We're looking for ghost writing. We're looking for dots and we're looking for orbs. Um, it doesn't have to be orbs though with a they. So it is dots and hi. Yeah, you're spooky, and you threw a painting at me. Uh, dots and orb. So what else? Writing dots, writing orb. So more than likely, it's going to be ghost writing and dots. Let's try to get that real quick. And basically, if I see either one, I'm, I know what it is. If it's not writing or dots, then we got something different. Then something's fishy. Because uh, Mimic would also be working. There goes the ghost writing. And wait for it. Let's see where the dots are. In three, two, one, dots. Dots. <laughs> it's, not, it's not gonna do that. There goes the other ghost writing. Now dots. You know how perfect of a clip that would have been if it showed up dots as soon as it did the ghost run. <laughs> so I shittily edited it together to show them. I was like, oh look, it's that. And then <laughs> jump cut to me and completely in a different position. All right, well indeed ghost writing. So definitely between that and you see what it rolls down to. Uh, and without the spirit box, it can't be a Moroi. Um, I mean, we'll ask again for Moroi. Morois can't be that active. But usually not. Where are you? How old are you? How old are you? Where are you? Are you here? Close? How old are you? Are you friendly? French? Where are you? How old are you? It was a crawling ghost, so it's probably going to be a crawling so let's scoop these down. They're always tough to see. That should be um, and then, like, Moroi has uh, freezing as its other evidence. However, Moroi has a forced spirit box evidence. So if you do not get spirit box, you cannot have a Moroi and you cannot have a Diod. Both of them have a forced response on spirit box. And there is your dots. There you go. Indeed a they. I just wanted to show the proof that I do kind of know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Some, sometimes. Sometimes. I talk out of my ass half the time, but for that, at least I know. <laughs> Welcome back. Mimic. <laughs> wow, 600 bucks. That was a complete and utter waste. Look at that, 111% sanity to loss. Uh, how much did it eat? I was in the kitchen for that long and it only ate. Okay, how long was I in the kitchen? 
I was in the ghost room for four minutes and it only aged three times. Uh, which according to, to the wiki and uh, fav devs and stuff, that's supposed to be 10 years apiece. So it would have aged 30 years. Um, however, due to my own math, that's not possible because I had one that was already in the 60s and it blasted like a bat out of hell to kill me. And it was still extremely fast. So, um, and it actually, it aged four and a half times, I think is what I had. It was the weirdest thing because I asked it what its age was. And it said 42. And then I asked it a little bit later and it said 45. <laughs> I was like, huh? That's not right. <laughs> uh, they, new ghost. Where'd my water go? I've moved my water enough. All right, let me get a spin before I do. Break is going. I do a power for the ads, of course. Um, Twitch decided to increase my ad time from a minute and a half. I used to deal with just a minute because I enjoyed that. I enjoyed not having to run the house and stuff. I may set it back to one minute because they really aren't doing much for me anyway. <coughs> it just gives bigger breaks in between. It is nice to have a little bit of a drink break and whatnot. Um, and since, since I only do minute and a half, I don't like any of the fun games and stuff. I try to do like little, little tidbits and stuff like that. I got nothing today. It's uh, I'm I'm still fighting a sickness. Um I did uh, lower all of my little timers and stuff so you won't see as many timers or you'll see them more concise more precise all right welcome back um let's get a spin and then i'll do the hit lines. all right the good old indecisive ghost not a bad one at all let's get a new prediction here so we did knock out the Thay that last time. That one is now considered a repeat. If you are wagering points against it. A ghost I haven't seen in a while. I have not seen the... I haven't seen the Hantu in a while. Yeah, the Hantu and the Yurei, I actually haven't seen in a little while. Hmm. All right. That one there. So we've got to set this up for Indecisive Ghosts, uh, which pretty much just means what you think it means. This ghost uh, likes to change favorite rooms a lot, and it doesn't like giving events. So you'll never know where it's at. It is going to change rooms. Do whatever the hell it feels like. <laughs> um, which there is one ghost in the game that breaks indecisive. Or indecisive ghost. The Gorio cannot change rooms. So the Gorio can never be an indecisive ghost. Uh Wraith can move a lot. <laughs> we got Carlos Nielsen. All right, so we're back to the full set of equipment. Um, and then the, yeah, and then the basics. Now the thing, the thing with the raid, uh, that, that lore little, uh, the lore text and whatnot saying that it's afraid of salt is complete and utter garbage. 
It's not that it's afraid of salt, it's that it will never step in salt. Um, it doesn't avoid salt. I have definitely noticed wraiths just kind of just doing their thing, going wherever the hell it feels like. I have never noticed a wraith actually physically avoid salt. Like during a hunt, you can clearly kite them over top of salt. It won't care. It's just kind of just lore based. It's just that was a double game punch. I, th I think we have a year right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I think you're a Yure. I mean, you you can think differently, but I heard that. That sounded like a double door touch. Jeez. Testy. <laughs> I'm not sure which door that was, so I know the ghost is at least in this area. Oh, I hit a nerve with that guy. <laughs> I, I did just say that the ghost I haven't seen in a while is a Hantu and a Yure. And Yure is my favorite ghost because its ability is just off the wall bananas. It has the ability to shut the front door. It's the best. I mean, I've had times. So I've, I've had times when I've played solo. And um, I never, I didn't ever question it. I would walk in the house, I would have the door open, I'd go back out to the truck, grab something, go back into the house, and I'd look, and I'm like, I'd have to open the door. I never thought twice about it back then. Now, only to realize that you're an idiot. It's a URA. <laughs> it's like, it's the only ghost that could do that. Oops, I just lost my thermometer. All right, which room are you throwing things in? Is it this room or that? Here's to be that. Bathroom. And I am really struggling with my mouse right now. Uh, it is bathroom. Yes. Okay, which one did you throw? Balsam? Did it say balsam? Looks like it says balsam. I gotta get a better look. I can't see. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, let's get an EMF so we can figure out exactly what the hell this thing is doing. Um, but that would be one urine ability already. I'm gonna try to keep track. If it's a urine. It doesn't have to. I, I think that that was the urine. I, that right there. Did you see that? That was two of the exact same identical EMF signatures. That's a Ure. So that's two. That's two EMFs. Okay, I want this thing to shut the front door on me. Um, okay, let's start picking it down. Let's see. Uh, freezing uh, orb and dots. Freezing orb and dots. Okay, if we see orbs... And we got a good chance that this could be a Yure. That was a single door touch. Yeah, see, the EMF reader will catch. That was a single door touch. We'll catch the Yure's ability. So you'll see two identical EMF readings. Uh, no fingerprints, so it is not one of those other ghosts. Do that. So we are looking for freezing and dots. Uh, just because I didn't see ghost orbs. So freezing and dots, probably. The two ghost orbs. So okay. This, this thing is teasing. It's currently outside. The you are not outside. The what? It's either. Oh, hey, you're not in your race. A Yure, that is interesting. They're not twins. Is this another Fae then? Could it just have done two events very quickly? 
Who's just into events very quickly? Probably not a shade at this point. Poltergeist. Could have done a poltergeist ability on the door, actually. Because technically you could touch the door and do the poltergeist throw and it looked like the same EMF. All right, let's see. Do we have freezing? It is not freezing. It does not appear to be going. Uh, so no orbs as step and salt. So we're looking for probably dots and spear points. Dots or spear points. Dang, I thought this was going to be a urine. Okay, so it, it, it does seem to be an ability using ghosts, though, because of the EMF that it's triggering. Because the ghosts with abilities will set off the EMFs. This or you gonna be this? Where are you? How old are you? Are you here? Are you close? How old are you? Where are you? It's currently outside. Where are you? How old are you? Are you friendly? Are you French? Where are you? Here? Close? How old are you? Where are you? Where are you? How old are you? Where are you? Friendly, French, where are you? How old are you? Pizza, your taco, your grandma, how old are you? Where are you? Where are you? So you're not. Thank you. Uh, thank you, ladies and gentlemen. I just wasted time. Just wasting my time. Wasting my time. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, so not spirit box, so that would rule out the Brian Dio. So are you dots? Are you polka dots? Did it move? No, I think it is still here. Temperature is still the same. Check the hallway. Temperature reading goes up. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, I do see cold breath out here. Maybe because the ghost is walking around. Let's see if it goes down in here. Uh, it still goes down in here, so that means the ghost is still in this room. Where did that go? Uh oh. Oh, there. Oops, that is too close. That should be good. <laughs> <coughs> All right, so there was no UV. Uh, oh, EMF five, EMF five. Ha, ah. look. Oh, the shitty trio. Spirit, Shane, and Myling. The three hardest to figure out. Well, this is the only way to figure them out. Throw that outside. Let me grab a... I don't know. Spirit, Shane, and Myling is a good old... We need to get a hunt. We need to get a smudge timer. We need to figure out if this ghost is fading in. Good lord. Oh, I hate these three. I hate these three so much. How do we tell? Um, if we have a myling, I will point it out. I will absolutely point it out if we have a myling, because what I'm going to do is get it to come to the kitchen. And uh, I will just say, it's like, as it walks, I'll say like, um, and say like I hear no footsteps, I hear no footsteps, and then there's the fade. Like, I'll, I'll say that. But I will grab the flashlight just in case it's a miling. As of right now, I think...
I don't know what it threw. Um, I think that this one is just a spirit. There is another way to check for miling. Um, you can listen on the parabolic. Uh, the milings will whisper on the parabolic a heck of a lot more than any other ghost other than the banshee. And if, say, you get four whispers within a minute, then you're looking at either a banshee or a milling. Um, now, all ghosts can whisper at, at certain intervals, but uh, the miling and banshee are the two that will constantly much as they can. Uh, and if you get four whispers and you don't have a banshee scream, more than likely you have the other mile. But it's obviously T. The only guarantee with the miling is the flashlight flicker fade in, which is, it's really hard to watch for. You kind of just have to listen. And um, I mean, I still get four. Uh, and then the uh, lights flickering, like the hallway lights and stuff. The reason why they're flickering is because the ghost is walking close to the light switch. Um, so anytime the ghost walks near a light switch, it will like flicker the area. It is nice to watch for. Um, like if you keep an eye on it, you can kind of watch and see where the ghost is roaming back and forth. <coughs> um, with a mare, if you see the lights flickering like way down the hallway, then you know that the mare is currently running towards darkness. It's like it's going to stay in a dark area and then come back to its room. So you'll see each area click as it comes back. To its room. Obviously, we don't have a mirror now, but that, that's something to watch for. I've learned to actually follow the mare like, as it leaves towards a dark room and turn on the light switches, turn them all off so it goes back towards its room. And then when it's back in its room, turn the light switch on. More than likely, you'll get the, uh... Shit. More than likely, you'll get the, uh, mare to actually use its ability at that point. And, uh, shut the door. But that's just a tip it. Mare! Which, obviously, this is not. Um, which cursed item do we have? Was it here? Uh, is it tarot cards? Okay. Who not? They've already thrown the crucifix outside. Uh, is it Buddha? Is it monkey? It's not monkey. Okay. Uh, when you get the shitty trio, monkey paw is amazing. Because uh, you can set your sanity at 50%. If the ghost hunts at that point, you know you're dealing with either a spirit or a miling. Uh, if it doesn't hunt until it, until you hit 40% or lower sanity, you have a shade. So it is a wonderful shade test. Ugh. It's the worst one. The absolute worst one. Okay, um, let's see. Have we been hit with an event? No, we have not. So, about 70%. Let's get to 50. I mean, I'm playing on Nightmare, so I don't know exactly what the sanity is, but we haven't been hit with any ghost events. Maybe one. So, let's see. Candles, probably three would do. I think three would bring us to hunting range. About 11% a piece, or 8% to 11% a piece. That would probably bring us out in range. Okay, I'm gonna mute just to make sure I don't accidentally trigger anything additional. I don't want any extra things to happen. Now, the reason why I didn't light them all is because that forces a cursed hunt. And a cursed hunt simply lasts 40% longer, and then every hunt from then on would then be a cursed hunt. It just makes uh, figuring out hunts harder. It is not a shade. It is not a miling. It is not a miling. You can hear the footsteps and the flashlight is not flashing. This is a spirit. We will do spirit tests. Hello. And smudge. 
that. 215.10. It was naked tonight. <sighs> Any day now. Thank you. 215.10. I mean, really don't need to go much further with that. Uh, could double check to make sure it's not a shade. I don't think it is. I think it's just a spirit. Uh, 215.10, so that'd be 218.10 would be it. This would be the, the third, probably the third one. Uh, it is three minutes from the time when you smudge or you use incense. Uh, the spirit cannot hunt for exactly three minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. Okay. <laughs> um, while well, the demon can hunt in 60 seconds after being smudged, all their ghosts are 1 minute and 30 seconds or 90 seconds. The spirit is 3 minutes. <coughs> I already forget what I said. 2 216. No, it's 215. 2, 215, 08, something like that. I don't know. But 21808 is when it's going to actually be. If it is a spirit. Oh, you suck. Shut up. Poop on you. Because I know what you are. <clears throat> it has been two minutes. So a normal ghost can hunt already. Spirit won't be able to hunt for another 45 seconds, I think. And we go ahead and set this up. Waiting. I like making a mess of the bunch of waiting. Oops, no. And I just make a mess in the kitchen. There's nothing you can do about it. Oh, by the way, there's a potato here. Oops. Here. Oh, yep. Gotta get the potato. Gotta get the ghost to interact with the potato. Oops. Don't drop that there. Jeez. Somebody's gonna get to it. I uh, spirit will build a hunt in about five seconds. And uh, the potato is a reference to psychohypnotic. Hi. Did you not like what I did with the potato? I don't care. You're a spirit. Alrighty then. Uh, he was one of the uh, first to like play testers along with uh, Enzo. Uh, Psycho Hypnotic was playing for a lot longer than him, apparently. Um, but uh, he's Tim. He's a uh, streamer. Yeah, <laughs> at this point. <laughs> I will reference uh, a lot of his videos and stuff a lot of time. Because he is. Uh, Welcome back. I've got some jobs ready for you. Creator. He's not a citizen. <clears throat> it is 1.10 a.m. right now. It's quite late. <laughs> okay. Uh, but the timer I was referring to was um, a stream time. Recording time. It's the recording time. I just follow. Okay. That was another spirit. Yeah, another spirit. Yippee. <laughs> yeah, that was the, the time on recording that I did for that. Um, I mean, I can come up with a timer, like, for when I get, like, the, uh, the spirit timer and stuff. Um, but that's, it's a whole nother thing. It's having to hit a hot key. 
instead of just saying, this is the time, noted. <laughs> as long as I say it, I'll try, try to remember it. <coughs> All right, let's get another spin of the Zavi. That was an indecisive ghost success with zero ghost room changes. All right, the opposite of hear no evil is speak no evil. Wow, that one just sounded awful. Speak no evil. This is going to be the last one since my voice is on the way out, okay? I wish I could go for longer, but I simply can't. Oh, oh, oops, oops. Uh, new prediction, final prediction of the night there. Hope oh, no spirit box. Yes, no spirit box, no monkey paw. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> um, as of right now, my next one would be Monday. I want to say Monday. Um, I, I don't know quite yet because I've got a dentist appointment on Friday. I have, I have a tooth removed. Maybe another one filled, another one possibly removed, or uh, I don't know. Like, I've got bad tooth pain that needs to get fixed um but my i think i'm gonna go back to my normal schedule start next week which would be monday tuesday friday saturday and uh it typically starts tip, the, the typical start time is 10 30 try to do 10 30 uh eastern standard time what am i doing <laughs> oh speak no you okay i just need to go to two nights Nothing changes. Uh, Edgefield is going to be the last one of the night. There we go. No, I mean, I'm, not, I'm definitely not overdoing it. I've only had two streams this week. I just wanted to make sure to, to get something. We've arrived. Check the equipment. Because, get up <laughs> like, when I don't do it, I just, you do know, I like playing right this game. <laughs> I like playing this game and games in general. It's like, I don't usually play games. It's either I stream or I'm watching a video or something. You know? Um, but yeah. And ending early today. No, I have tomorrow. So, basically. We'll probably celebrate that. I'm still very much so rough. Uh, the good thing is, at least I had the energy today to build function. Past few days, I have had no energy. It's just, I don't know. I don't know if this is long COVID related or anything like that. I really hope not, because I hope that this cough doesn't continue forever. Because this is terrible. I think it's um, I think it's a, a, a tooth infected. Um, oh, it's Ouija board. Shit. <laughs> oh dear, it's Ouija board. I can't use it. That means I can't force a hunt. Oh no. Okay, we're gonna have to play the dark game. Yeah, get it getting into affiliate is no no problem. That, that really doesn't take a lot. I will give you a little bit of a tip. Uh, if you have a, a phone, a tablet, or anything like that, that, you can turn on and log on to a separate account. You can use the same email. Um, Sammy Bot my, uh, is my secondary account. Um, I don't use it anymore as a view, like as a view, um, but you can use it as a view. It's a demon! It's not a demon. You just broke it. You are a bastard, man. I don't like it. I don't like that they changed it. The, the hunt sounds now are used for events. It's so, like, it, it always catches me off guard. Hi. Okay, so you're here. You're either here or in this room. Are you in this room? Oh, could be. All the way you're in this room. You're in this room. Killer. Hey, there's the bone. It doesn't have a leg to stand on. <laughs> I'm sorry, was that a bad joke? Jeez. <laughs> I 
Good God. Okay, um, it is not freezing. Let's grab some more evidence. You broke the main... Mm. May I ask you a question, sir? I know I can't talk to it right now. It broke the main light, but it did not break that light? That's yeah, weird. Weird, weird, weird. Okay, to sewer up. And for you today. Um, let's sh throw this out the frickin' door because we can't use this. Okay, let's bring this, this, and this. I can't even ask it. <laughs> uh, I can't even say give me a sign. See, I can't do any of that stuff. So I said originally when I came up with these three, I was like, well, speak no evil is probably going to be the easiest. And uh, hear no evil is probably going to be the hardest. And of course, the, this one which is a pain in the ass. Uh, we do have an ad break. I'm going to step out of the house and it's going to shut off a light. <laughs> Ghost is right on time. that I'm keeping um keeping hydrated <laughs> feeling called out ah you can blame frosty I didn't have to do that the Shrek got no evidence but we have a very active gun I'll have to read what that says. <clears throat> uh, why did my chat get scared in a hallway? Because when the light flickered, they saw the reflection and thought it was a ghost. But don't worry, Sammy Bot kept things linked together while the hybrid mixed up AM and PM like a true night owl. And Kata Sura, they're cheering on chin kicking support as we all aim for affiliate stars. <laughs> oh, it just teases everybody. You're not the only one. Oh my god. Okay, so it shut off every single light and then it turned on a light. Okay, well, it can't be a mare. You did not touch anything. You just had an EMF too. Jen? I wonder if that was Jen ability. There's nothing thrown. Nothing thrown. The door was not touched. Oh, 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 that's um, Ghost Rider. That's what happened. That was one, two, and three. Holy oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> and it starts. Huh? How much more clear do I have to be that that is a Dots ghost photo? What? Are you kidding me? Clip. <laughs> Good God. What the hell? Cannot be a mimic because it is Dots. Uh, dots and ghost writing. It is a deal or it is a thing. It is a thay. It is a thay again. Easy. Not on a personal space. That could be. It could be why they didn't count. Well, I blew the perfect investigation. Um, but we know exactly what it is because I said it earlier and I'll say it again. I can't ask for spirit box. And I don't need it. Diogen is a spirit box response. Has to be. Stop it. <laughs> okay, stop. Don't look at that while I'm on stream. Good lord. Okay, okay, Thay, I'm done with you. We're good. We're done. Don't even give me that we're not done yet thing. 
What, what, what is the one? Nice set of hooters you got there. The owls. They're beautiful. That was a per it was the perfect picture. Another thing. Uh, and that was a speak no evil success. So let me pull up the well actually let's do this real quick. They is a repeat. So I started tonight with only six ghosts knocked off. Or five yeah, yeah, yeah six five ghosts knocked off. And I ended up marking off one. Three bloody repeats. <laughs> Did I only do three investigations? No, 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 no. I'm missing one. Miling was the other one. So four. Four. One, two, three. Yeah, one, two, three, four. Holy hell. How does that happen? Well, they ended up marking off two, two new ghosts. That is absolute insanity. Let's see how much it actually aged. It aged four times. I was in the ghost room for two minutes and it aged four times. So the other investigation was four minutes and it aged three times. This one, when I was in the room for, for two minutes, essentially. And it aged four times. I, I don't know. See, uh, and that's Ouija board. Oh no. See, that's when Ouija board is the best. Because you could ask it how old it is and it would have given you an answer and then it would have gone up and it immediately knew. Hey. Uh, all right, so what did we... Uh, so we ended up getting, so we had zero sanity. Zero sanity was a success with a death. Um, speak no evil was a success. Hear no evil was a success with an almost death. Um, and then our, earlier I had picture roulette, which was a success. I don't think I failed once. Indecisive Ghost, which was a success. And then um, I think that was it. Um, yeah. Success. I had one death, which I mean, I'm going to consider that a fail, but still it was one death. Oops. I meant to hide this. There we go. Ha. Okay. Uh, let's see out here i'll back out here and then i will say good night to you two here back. there's some jobs ready for you flip out of here so i can get a perfect outro for youtube look at my logo look at that i finally put it into my stream because <laughs> usually i just had my um my e kind of gaming i actually do like that a lot uh, it does look a little bit cleaner and it does kind of uh blend in a little bit more than uh the original logo but uh, yeah, I do like that. Oh, I, I love this one. This was actually made by um, uh, Vicky underscore three 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 from uh, Mayhem Gaming uh, originally. She, she made that one and a few others for free. Game claims bathroom. <laughs> Upstairs in the hallway, game claims bathroom. Ah, that's lovely. What's that? Oops, I meant to do this. Um, but um, yeah, she, she made uh, it was four emotes, I believe she made for me for free when I book right before I hit affiliate. Um, I asked her for that. She provided those and then I used them and kind of did my own twist and then made them into the logo. I made them into different emotes and then I started designing my own emotes and stuff from that point on. Um, but anyways, uh, for YouTube, uh, we will see you next time. I am going to be ending early so that I can get some rest and rest my all this stuff you can click on this button here to subscribe if you haven't already and you can also click this video if you like to watch more videos click this link if you like to watch more videos i gotta stop